So the question we have, a cylindrical tube is of length 100 cm, so length is equal to 100 cm and it contains some mercury inside it. If the length of the air column remains constant at all temperatures, this is of liquid, we need to find the length or the height of mercury. This is of mercury and gamma or coefficient of real expansion of mercury is given. It is 18 into 10 to the power of minus 5 inverse of degree Celsius and gamma of the glass or the tube is given it is 2.7 into 10 to the power of minus 5 inverse of degree Celsius so in the question we have we they have given that the air column remains constant so how much ever uh, there is change in volume of mercury that much only there will be change in glass this is of Hg and this is of the glass volume formula we know volume of Hg they have also told we should neglect the expansion of uh, cross-sectional area so vol we know delta V is V gamma delta T this these are all for Hg and for glass it is V of glass gamma of glass into delta T so volume we know it is area into length area into length length of mercury we need to find or the height of which mercury is there and they have also told us to neglect the um, expansion of cross section into gamma is uh, 1, 1 18 into 10 to the power of minus 5 delta t delta t for both of them will, will be same so delta t and delta t will get cancelled so volume of uh, glass is area into length it is 100 into gamma 2.7 into 10 to the power of minus 5 as they have told to neglect the expansion of cross section so I am removing area so length 10 to the power of minus 5 10 to the power of minus 5 will get cancelled so length is equal to 100 into 27 into 2.7 by 18 so 9 twos, 9 zero point threes, 2 ones, 2 fifties so length is equal to 50 into 0 0.3 which is 15 centimeters so the option is 2